Kai, welcome to the EBB Stadium and welcome to Aldershot. How's it feel to sign? Yeah, no, I'm buzzing to be fair. Um, bit of a relief finally to to start something new, have something to kind of look forward to and try and build on a season, really. And the thing I always ask a new signing, uh, from, from your own mouth, what, how would you describe yourself as a player? Uh, I'd probably say someone that likes to get on the ball, make stuff happen going forward. Um, I like to have a lot of shots. Set pieces is kind of my thing as well. But yeah, getting forward really. Now you did actually train with the squad this morning, didn't you? First impressions, all good? Yeah, yeah, no, all good. Yeah, the lads are all all nice, all welcoming. Um, yeah, good to get on the grass, new faces, but yeah, nice. Have you ever met any of them before? I know sometimes it's, it's you know, you cross paths with people, don't you? But Yeah, yeah, no. Maxi is the only one that I played with when I was younger, um, Redding. But apart from that, yeah, all new faces. But that, that's, you know, sometimes that's a good thing, isn't it? Exciting yeah, yeah. times ahead, meeting new people. Yeah, yeah, no, it's, yeah, it's good, it's good. I'm sure after a week or so, it won't be new faces, it will just be the squad. But for now, yeah. And looking at your uh, footballing past, you know, you've got quite a good little CV of clubs there. You know, you, you've uh, you played at youth level for, for Arsenal and Reading and, and I think you've been on trial at a few good clubs, haven't you? And, and coming through the West Ham youth ranks as well. Yeah, yeah. Talk us through those experiences. Yeah, no, all very different, all very different. Just kind of growing up, obviously, my dad tried to get me into as many clubs as I could yeah. um, to have the best options when it did come to signing at nine. Um, signed at Arsenal then and then the rest is all history and I mean you were born in Spain weren't you but yeah. uh, not much of a Spanish accent but nah. you know mo moving abroad at a young age was, was that something difficult or was that alright well yeah so I was born there and then I lived there for five years six years and then come to England but my, my family are pretty much English yeah. I have some Spanish that live in Spain but pretty much English so at home, it was always speaking English. Although I spoke Spanish because of school and that kind of stuff, um, I sound English. <laughs> so can we expect any Spanish flair on the pitch? Uh, hopefully, hopefully <laughs> so, yeah. But, um, you know, looking ahead now to the season, you come into the shots having a pretty good season last year for us. But is that something you're excited to, to push on with and, and ahead of the new Vanarama National League season? Yeah, no, definitely. Yeah, something that obviously I, I watched. I watched some games last year and it all looked very nice attacking attacking football that I like um, but with obviously a few a few of the lads going from last year I'd like to try and get in the team and play games and score goals you join us from Peterborough where you know you had a lot of success in their under 21 side didn't you I think we saw in the, at the end of the 2023 season you were you know, named as their player of the season for the under 21s and you did actually get a championship appearance whilst you were there didn't you so mm -hmm. so you know how was it at Peterborough yeah no it was good it was good um Obviously, it was, it was very different to where I came from when I came from West Ham. Um, but that was kind of what I wanted. I wanted to be more in a first-team environment. Um, I got that, uh, but I just need to kind of build on it and play more games now, really. So ready to push on this season, get yeah. in that first team, hopefully, on August 10th and, and push on from there, right? Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Welcome to the shots. Thank you.